And we're back. And we're gonna go back to where we began. We're gonna see what this how this works out. There's a lot of cats at the end of time, Novia. Well, there's the potential to be a lot of cats. Preparations are complete. The space-time warp you entered was caused by a powerful magical source. This type of force always creates a counterforce. These mage towers will gather the force and recreate the warp. I sense something. Not these creeps again. Those spirits will drain the tower's energy. I suppose we have no choice. We must protect the towers. If this doesn't work now, you'll never get home. So, that's a thing. Okay, defend the towers for five turns. If all the towers die, or if Ash dies, we lose. They are the same level as they were before. It is hard to protect all the towers. See, because we can't hit him, and he's going to come up and hit this tower. The best strategy here is probably to just pick a tower and just put everybody around it. You can try to have people act as bait. Might be able to. Yeah, they're designed to be fairly weak. Problem is, we can't do anything about this one. Well, I can't really get to anything yet. We'll give it a shot. We can always, um... Can these do anything? No. Shame. Be neat if you could cast magic with them. Because, yeah, it's like the sand, the antlion attack uh, mission, where you're going to get a bunch more people to attack. These things are fairly harmless, though. I forget how many hits a tower can take. It is a good pain, Novia. The warp is overtaking us. See, one of them is going to get to a tower. I don't think Piercing Ray will do it. Rolling Fire might, though. Uh, Banana gave me a key. We did that earlier. Maybe Piercing Ray will kill them. That one had more hit points. That's no good. Okay, let's go try Piercing Ray. Ah, uh, that means this one's gonna live. Shit. Maybe Grog will be more tempting than, t than the tower. It'd be nice if Zohar had actually killed them on the counterattack. We'd have them all dead, which would be nice. We might be able to take out a tower. That would suck. How many this time? Two? Three? Four? Oh yeah, that's not great. Attack Grog and get counterattacked to death? That would be lovely. Yeah, as soon as we get everyone back together, we'll do the, uh, the, the key. Grog is pretty great. I like this bit, because, like, when I first played the game, I was like, Sarah, I was like, oh, you're like Huxley, except not as good. Especially when I'd made her a monk. I was like, oh, you're not as good a healer as Huxley. I don't know what to do with you. Uh-oh. 
that's that one. Um, and Grog was just, eh, I mean, Dolan was a leader of his own little group. A little longer! And, uh, Clint is your buddy from before everything went bad. So, it, it's nice for Grog and Sarah to accompany Ash into the warp to kind of, you know, kind of get their own little adventure. Give them some, a chance to get some character. Now, the very first time I did this, I did what I'm doing now, and it didn't go well. So anymore, I kind of took the uh, strategy of just huddling around a tower until the until we win. This is more entertaining, though. Closer to, I think his final uh, class is Paragon. Ah, you old bastard! You're being sneaky. So we're going to lose those towers. We'll turn us to turn four. Yeah, because I can't get to him. Cure status wide, stone shower, that won't help. Come on, nummy grog butt. It's the most delicious. Phase shift? Well, that'll work. Why not? Yep, I guess it's phase shift. You guys are going to love this. Hold on to your butts. Yep, it's a hell of a thing. Okay... Uh, none of them should be able to get to it. Well, I guess they'll be able to attack it next turn. Damn. We're destroying the towers! Okay. So this is the last turn, so we need to kill these two. Okay, now at least one tower will survive. Thank you. 
some extra kills. That's nice. Quit eating, Mo Wizard. I wonder how much these guys are going to be worth. If they're going to be worth 330 again, or maybe some more? That'd be nice. Cool. Hey, good job, sir. Sigma's got 110 hit points. That's nifty. Well, we're not really getting experience from these guys anymore, though. That's a bummer. We did it! Huzzah! Oh, they are worth more. Nice. Good god, it's a sparky massacre. Well, and giant metal gauntlets, too. The warp will open any moment now. Oh, yeah, that big blue thing. There it is! Everyone, jump in! Well, as long as it doesn't spit us out somewhere stupid or dangerous. I mean, but what are the odds of that happening? What indeed? Well, this doesn't seem great. Give up, traitors! You're surrounded! Zoot catch, you slime bag! You may work for the Empire now, but you're still just a petty thief. The criminals have hired us. The Empire's hired criminals to swell the ranks of the army. Now these scoundrels steal from the innocent under the protection of the Empire. Tis a sad sight to behold. And I was foolish enough to trust Dolph. Don't blame yourself. We all fell for it. What's the delay? The villagers in this area are rebel sympathizers anyway. Torch it. We'll burn all these villagers to the ground. Not while I'm alive, you won't. That's double for me. This is uh, where it would be handy to have Diego be an archer still. We don't stand a chance. But we'll take as many of them out with us as we can. The odds aren't great. If only... Oh, right. Wibbly-wobbly, timely-wimey kind of stuff. Where are we? Looks like we made it back. I can't believe it! It's Ash! It can't be. Is it really you? Clive, my friend! Diego! What the? Where'd they come from? Now we can turn things around. Ash, they're Hell's Boys! Let's show them how the old Crunch play. Or the old Crunch play. Excuse me, excuse me. So these guys are pretty cool. I like the, the, um, this is basically the security forces repurposed towards the bad guys. They're not like Crimson Guard or anything. So we have Centurions, uh, they have better armor than we're used to fighting, so they are hard to kill. Um, we now have enemy clerics, the Deacon, he only knows healing though. And we have a Warlock, so we have enemy wizards, he knows Rainbow Stroke, which I think is Piercing Ray. I think. And we have Grenadiers. These are the new archers. They don't... I don't think they do the same kind of damage as an arrow would against a wing knight. But we're going to try to avoid finding out. And there's these damn bats again. The Grenadiers are kind of a piss. Um, so they're going to come up this way. Let's see... Dolan and Huxley can hold this indefinitely. We also want to go get this treasure at some point. I think we'll just leave this one alone. Uh, let's see. Don't lose Clive? Nope. Clive can die. Do I get to control? No, I don't get to control Clive. So he's free to do all kinds of stupid shit. Go 
Go, Huxley! Oh, you know it, dude. You know it. Empire's a bunch of... A bunch of weasels. Okay. So... That is a big thing. I wonder how many people I can hit with that. Okay. Zohar, how many people... Can you phase shift from here? Because that'd be... Whoa! He got a whole new spell, too. That looks like that aura gem thing I just learned how to do. Or got the item for. Uh, what about... Phase shift? Phase shift is always from his target spot. He uses a lot of magic, though. That's a third of his magic, so... I'm gonna invent him. Uh, Piercing Ray? Oh, can't hit anybody. Okay. Well, let's stick... Grog and Ash up front. Protect their flanks. Let everyone come in and get magicked by Zohar next turn. Boy, he's slow. That's unfortunate. And Sarah. Uh, Mystic Shield. Who are they more likely to attack? Any of well, They're more likely to attack whoever I don't use Mystic Shield on. The music seems a lot louder than it was earlier. Everything sound okay, guys? I just want to make sure. Okay, that's everybody. Let's see what the bad guys do. God, there's a lot of them. But we have more wonderful area of effect magic. Uh-oh. He's going uphill. Yeah, that's... Yeah, that's not quite the same as archers. You guys want to all get on a nice line? That'd be nifty. Good, good. Thank you. Oh, nice! My Mystic Barrier worked. Oh boy, these guys are dog meat. You guys can't even begin to hurt us. We've been tempered by battling hell spirits. Oh yeah, we should probably look for secret items. I don't think there's a secret item on this map that I need. Yeah, he's gonna come up that way. Uh, you sneaky bitches. A lot of damage on Ash. Oh, uh, nope. He's attacking Grog. Okay. Whew! Bring in the pain. You guys just gonna hang out up there? Nope. Oh, that could be bad. Well, that's a pain in the ass. Thief Lord now. Clive's gonna go fight the bat. Okay, well... Eh, I'll take it. Oh, nice. I can get down there from here. That's cool. What are you? You're a big herb. Oh, those are... That's gonna be a thing. Uh, let's see. Anything we need to loot? There's a treasure over there that I'm not too stoked about. Oh, there's a thing right back here. Well, shit. Oh, that's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt really bad. <laughs>
Oof. I'd like to do more damage, but I'm going to hit by two grenades and probably a rainbow stroke, so I should probably come out and heal. Fairy bots! There we go. That was an eventful turn, too. You piss ant. I'm gonna come down there and murder the shit out of you. I hope that other Grenadier can't hit me. This could be awkward. You can do it, Clive. We believe in you. Eventually, you can do it. <laughs> uh, nope, he's going to shoot Zoar. Good, good, good. That'll work. That'll work. No, no, we're fine, we're fine. Totally fine. Rainbow stroking Zoar. Ooh, I don't like your ass. Yeah, wizards have trouble hurting each other, though, which is convenient. And try and heal that one I crippled. Time for him to die. Thief Lord is still kind of just hanging out. That's better. Hey, good job, Clive. Dolan, how far into this mess can you get? Pretty far. Hey, guys. And this is why we have two sorcerers, because monks don't learn this. Most of them are dead. It's a wondrous thing. Wow, that was... He got a lot of experience for healing someone higher level than him. That's a neat mechanic. Um, I mean, does there... Uh, uh, maybe? Might bring Zood into the fight, which I don't want, though. God damn. Those guys are pathetic for archers. Okay, now Clive should be able to kill the Bat-Bat. We believe in you, Clive. You badass samurai guy, how come you can't be on our side? So we got a grenadier and a wizard left. Oh, and that cleric. Good shot. Yes, yes, very much so. 
Rainbow Stroke? Boy, they're going after Huxley hard. Man, magic also doesn't work very well on priests. Gonna heal yourself? Of course you are. Of course you are. You little babby. Uh, normally I would focus more... Oh, there's another treasure there. Don't die. Okay, good. Don't kill him. There's treasure we need to get, damn it. How much magic that deacon got left? Nine. Okay. <laughs> What's here? Shit. Have to examine it. Damn it. A chess piece? Oh, I think that's a heal. I think that's a cure. I don't know what the hell that is. Might be a cure spell. I'll go get this treasure. How many rainbow strikes does asshole have left? Probably one more. I'm about out myself. <laughs> That's a cool spell. Damn it, Dolan. Move faster. Uh, that's everybody. Okay, got two items to get. Neither of them should be very important. Well, I'm hoping Zoot's gonna try and kill Huxley instead of Diego. I always thought it was a play on Roman Candle. Ouch! I must make a strategic withdrawal! You can do it, Huxley. We believe in you. Okay. Let's see. Go away, ball. Nice. Perfect amount of movement. What do we get? An elixir. Cool. Gold coins, huh? Okay. Getting tired of your shit, buddy. Now, I got bad news for you, Warlock. You were instrumental in killing the tank's healer. He doesn't appreciate that. Dark Star? Yeah, what the hell with it? Go hit him with a Dark Star. Nope. Too far away. Go hit him with your stick. Clive, don't go get killed by Zoot. That would be silly. Suicide by Hawk Knight. Uh, Diego could probably use some more experience. Oh, Clint gonna get the kill? You kill stealing dick waffle. <laughs> Appropriate though. I, I I I approve. I approve. Oh, he got 32 experience. Good good job, Clint. You shit. Loads of money.
Commander Clive, well met. Ash, beyond hope. But where have you been these past three miserable years? Three years? We've only been gone a day! The truth is we're lucky to have come this close. We might have easily been off by twenty years or more. It can't be true. Let's go back to the village and talk it out. I forget what voice I did for Clive. <laughs> Tragedy. So that's what happened while we've been gone. Many good people want to resist Emperor Hell, but all of their leaders have been either executed or exiled. If only we could bring everyone under the same banner. Let's do that. We'll set off some fireworks that'll rouse the resistance from sleep. Fireworks, huh? What's the plan? We'll storm the Imperial prison. The one they brag is impenetrable. It would be a great victory for the rebels. That's where they hold the political prisoners. If we could free them, we might finally be able to organize ourselves. Clint, Eleni, and Ammon are being held there, too. It's perfect. Two birds with one stone. I think we should try it. I'll lead the troops during the actual attack. Clive, I want you to start trying to galvanize the resistance. I understand. Things are just starting to get interesting. Interesting. Interesting indeed. I think we get to buy stuff now. Oh boy. Um, let's save. <laughs> the impenet <laughs> This prison is impenetrable. But is it fully armed and operational? Okay, let's do some shopping and then I'll break the video and check some stuff. Uh, let's see. Oop. Well, you look odd. What do we got? Really, nothing new. Odd? Oh, nothing new yet. You can buy mage gems, though. Those are cool. Mega herbs are... they're ridiculous. Anyone have room for... nope. No one has room for anything. Oh, I'm not going to worry about it, then. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's check out the tavern, then. Before Emperor Hell came to power, people thought the Royalists were behind the terrorist attacks, but it looks like those were lies spread by Hell's party. Ah, still pretty close, though. The Empire has been doing strange things. On one hand, they're busy stamping out rebels. On the other hand, they're digging up ruins. What's going on? There are armies made up of criminals and thugs, but the Crimson Guard are something different. I've heard at the top there are five Crimson Generals. It's said that none have ever been bested in personal combat. Well, I'm sure nothing will ever come of that. Anyway, I'll see you guys in a minute. I'm going to break the video.